Do you know that 12 rounds of Surya Namaskar burn nearly 156 calories? Surya Namaskar or the sun salutation dates its origin back to the 20th century. This modern yoga asana is performed in 12 poses or steps and each asana focuses on benefiting a specific part of the human body. Surya Namaskar can be practiced by people of any age of group and the best time to perform this yoga asana is at sunrise. Today I brings to you an elaborate guide to perform 12 steps of sun pose and reap maximum benefits out of it. Surya Namaskar is performed by following 12 asana or poses systematically. These are the steps of Surya Namaskar and their health benefit explained in detail. First one is Pranamasana. Pranamasana or Anjali Mudra is the gesture of reverence that is considered as a sign of respect and greeting in India. Pranamasana is just like Namaste while standing straight, join the palms of both your hands while keeping the fingertips pointing up. Pranamasana or centering pose is a focus building and meditative yoga pose of Surya Namaskar. It helps to relieve mental stress and anxiety. The second one is Hasta Uttanasana. The name originates from Sanskrit word meaning upward tree. Recovering from Pranamasana, stand straight, raise your arms and gaze upwards. Stretch back and lengthen your spine. Make sure your feet remain on the ground and don't lose balance. Let go and retain standing position slowly. Hasta Uttanasana benefits people suffering from asthma. It helps encountering baggage, fatigue and mild anxiety. This pose also improves digestion. Avoid looking up if you feel dizzy and don't overstretch yourself. your arms if you experience pain during this surya namaskar pose the third one is uttanasana while exhaling bend forward and touch down your toes with your fingers it is all right to bend knees initially if you are in able to keep them straight while bending make sure your spine does not bend keep your neck and shoulders relaxed press into your heels softly so weight is evenly distributed uttanasana helps in recovering from insomnia and osteoporosis this step of surya namaskar relieves anxiety stress and headache it strengthens thighs and knees stretches hips hamstrings and calves this surya namaskar step should be avoided if you are suffering from lower back pain neck injuries heart problem or high blood pressure the fourth one is ashwa sanjalanasana while in uttanasana bend your legs and knees and place your palms on the ground in line with your feet breathe in and stretch back your right leg and bend left one at 90 degrees Balance your body on toes while distributing your weight evenly. Every yoga asana has its own health benefit. This sun salutation pose increases willpower. It strengthens spine and increases leg capacity. It stimulates digestive system and tones kidney and liver. This Surya Namaskar step should be not be practiced if you are suffering from knee or neck injury. The fifth one is Falakasana or Dandasana. Exhale and step your left leg back to form the plank pose. Make sure your shoulders, elbows and wrists remain perpendicular to the floor. Bring your shoulders plate, then widen your collar bone while spreading the shoulder blades. Roll and press your toes into the mat but avoid tightening your knees. keep your neck relaxed and aligned to spine dandasana the fifth step of surya namaskar tones the abdomen and helps building strength and 
endurance of arms shoulders and wrist don't practice this surya namaskar asana pose if you are suffering from severe low back pain and wrist injury the next one is ashtanga namaskara this sun salutation steps starts by dropping down from dandasana and touching your chin chest and knees to the ground at the same time place your chest right between your arms your elbows should be hugging your chest and pointing towards the ceiling make sure that your hips stay off the ground ashtanga namaskara turns and strengthens the arms shoulders legs this surya namaskar pose releases tension around the neck and shoulder it also improves spine flexibility patients suffering from buttock injury spinal pain or lower back pain should avoid this surya namaskar step the seventh one is bhujangasana inhale and raise your head to create a back bend while your palms place on the mat and elbows gently bent hugging your body roll your shoulders backwards and keep your neck relaxed your lower torso and legs should remain intact with the ground while performing this surya namaskar pose bhujangasana helps in strengthening the torso it turns abdominal muscles and improves blood circulation it helps during menstrual cycle and cures backache and sciatica this asana is also therapeutic for asthma in case you suffer stomach disorders like ulcer hernia back injury consult a doctor before practicing this surya namaskar pose the next one is adho mukha swanasana while exhaling lift your hips towards the ceiling push down your heels on the mat drop down your head while looking towards your navel make sure your neck and shoulders are relaxed and weight is entirely distributed on your limbs practice this surya namaskar technique and reap unimaginable health benefit this surya namaskar step has incredible health benefit it improves blood circulation calms the nerves and relieves stress for women it helps relieve symptoms of menopause back pain and headaches this asana should not be performed by people who are suffering from ear hernia eye or ear infection or wrist injuries the ninth one is ashya sanchalana asana from adho mukha svanasana inhale and bring your right foot forward and place it between your palms the 10th one is pada hastasana or uttanasana exhale slowly now bend down and place both your toes aligned to each other touch your toes with your fingers the 11th one is uttana hastasana raise your hand above and stretch back your spine gaze towards the ceiling while bending backwards the last one is again pranamasana the steps of surya namaskar end with where this yoga pose begins surya namaskar's final pose is anjali mudra join your palms together in the namaste gesture as you complete these 12 steps of surya namaskar one cycle of the asana is completed to avail the maximum benefit of this yoga pose start from 7 or 12 cycle of sun salutation per day to 21 24 54 or even 108 cycles as you master this technique with time surya namaskar pose is a connection of various asanas which in combination help to fight several body alignments This is the reason why it widely practiced throughout the world and recommended by medical professionals as well.